Hey everybody, this is Jesus, Jesus Christ, Jesus J, whatever you wish, I am, I am that I am, you are that you are, so I have a video for you today, um, something I found interesting and I want to talk about, this has been going on for a while, this Duck Dynasty thing, distraction, uh, farce, <laughs> you know, act. It's all what it is, is it's all classic divide and conquer. You know, they bring something like this up every three months. Last time it was Paula Dean, then before that it was dead. Da, 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 da. Every three months, it's going to be someone different once this dies down. Um, this guy I saw the other day, I didn't find definitive proof, but I'm pretty sure he's like a Freemason and I'm not saying that all Freemasons are bad I'm saying from what I understand in my research a lot of them are not uh, don't really give two shits about us and have um, an agenda so but no all Freemasons are bad usually past the third degree they have no clue what's going on themselves um, or up to the third degree, but anyway, so this is Phil Robertson, and now he's, someone has come out with a video, and this video has been around for a while, why it's just now coming out makes me, uh, raise an eyebrow, um, Duck Dynasty's Phil Robertson says, girls should marry when they are 15 years old, and that's not quite exactly how he said it, of course you know that, but, you know how these guys are with their titles and wanting to get reads. Um, that's very deceptive of you guys, by the way. But anyway, so, and this is a video. And then he says something about um, the Bible and God, which is God is everything. The word God just ties all the other things up. You know, puts it into one, and that's why it didn't work in Egypt with Akhenaten or Moses. But anyway, you know, sun worship only. But anyway, Luciferianism. But anyway, let me uh, play this for you so you can see what I'm talking about real quick. Here's a quote, Georgia. It is impossible to rightly govern the world without God and the Bible. George Washington, your first president, you know what they said? Name the capital of our country after him. You mean he's standing on God and the Bible. Let's name the capital of our country after him. And that's what they did. They erected a huge monument in his honor. Standing there right now, Washington, D.C., the Washington Monument. Okay, there you go. And earlier than that, he talked about, said something. You can go, I'll leave the link in the description. You can go listen to that thing if you want. Um, I'm more interested in this. Uh, because the other thing is just gossip BS. And it's to divide us, you know. It's to divide um, on race. And that's why they sent, I forget what his name was over here. After, um the slaves were quote unquote uh set free um which i understand a lot of them didn't want to be but what it is though is it wasn't everyday people like me and you that had slaves it was the clintons the gores and it was their exactly their great grandfathers their great great grandfathers their great 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 grandfathers and so on it was those individuals that owned the slaves, that had slaves. Um, make sure I'm mic'd up. Okay. So, um, it was them. They're, they're the ones that made the rules. And the way America was created, it was created. There was nothing about people leaving because of the tyrant over there, and then they came over. Maybe it was at first. I'm not sure, but 
what it ended up being was an infiltration and creation. George Washington, what he's talking about, was a Freemason. Um, I believe Phil Robertson, and like I said, no, they're not bad people, but some of them do have an agenda. They're in places of power, and they go to the lodge. They don't have backyard barbecues. They go to the lodge and rub elbows, corporate CEOs, and la da da medical, pharmaceutical, blah, blah, blah. Okay? This is a fact. So... He says that George Washington said, you cannot rightly govern a country without one, God and the Bible. Okay, let's analyze this for a minute. Um, govern. A lot of you mechanics probably know what that means, govern. Govern means to control. Okay? Mente means mind. In Latin, ment, government, government. It's control of your mind, mind control. And that's how they do it with God and the Bible and the cross, or the cross and the crown and royalty. This world is run by the cross and the crown. If you've ever seen that symbol, then you know why now. But anyway. This is governed to officially control lead, blah, blah, blah. I'll leave the link in the description area to control the way that something is done. Here is Mente. Um, ablative singular of men's mind. That entomology. The study of where words come from. Most of our English language is two Latin words put together to make another word. Or it's just straight out the Latin word pronounced different, spelled different. These guys um, are big on Latin. And while we're at it, let's look over here in the sidebar over here on this webpage. Britney Spears accused of faking her abs. Who cares? Who cares? Brody Jenner reveals family tension over Chris Jenner's intentions. Who gives a shit? Who cares? Why do we care? Why do we care about this shit? Why do we idolize these people? It's about coming out of the world. Jesus wasn't saying worship me. He was saying be like me because you are like me. Because you are me. Because the body is your temple and it's about inside. It's a consciousness. It's about realizing that you know, there's a god and a goddess. There's yin and yang. There's balance. There's cycles. Um, it's about nature. Or mother. Um, come out of her. I mean... Guns, is uh, we're not back in the 1700s. Guns are not going to help you. Feeding this beast is not going to help you. Starving the beast will help you. How do you do that? You grow food. Quit being materialistic. Quit going to big corporate malls, shopping centers. Go to Goodwill. Go to uh, garage sales. You know, get to know people make uh let's start villages again two people can pair up with one person has a house one doesn't they can pair up a couple nights a week for uh growing uh, growing things and split it tomato whatever because your stuff is being radiated and it's being genetically modified i hope you know so anyway there you go this is jesus signing off Take care. How do you feel about blacks? Blacks are all right. How do you feel about Jews? Jews are all right. How do you feel about women? Women, okay. I have nothing against no one unless they got something against me. You come up and say hi. I say hi. You say I like you. I say well I like you. You say well I don't like you. I say well I don't like you. In other words, however you reflect to me is what I'm going to reflect back to you. I don't care what color you are where you're from or what you're doing, what race you are. I am me first, and that is Scotch. I'm from Scotland first. That's me. And I look out for that, number one, me. Just like everybody else does.